Ghana discovered oil in commercial quantities in the western region in 2007 and began the actual drilling in 2010. Takradi, the regional capital, has since become a center of business for people with various professions. GTV takes a look at nightlife in the city of Black Gold. It is 1.45 a.m. in Takradi, and this is how some streets of the city look like. A visit to some popular joints in the city, however, paints a completely different picture. These are locations for brick sex work. Female sex workers can be seen plying their trade in order to survive. Public sex is a new thing that has caught on with some people in the twin city of Sekendita Kradi, and the trade has attracted both the young and old. One major worry is that the patrons, who are mostly old men, go in for girls as young as 13 years. Like any other business, these girls also encounter some challenges. Our interaction with one of the female sex workers reveals more. The police arrested me for improper dressing. I told them I was walking with a friend, but they insisted I call before they would release me. I tried several times to call, but was not successful. The police later demanded Alomo and five Ghana cities when my colleagues intervened. Alomo one bottle with five cities. Yeah, baby came all the way from Accra. Armed robbers attacked me in a car and tore my dress. They also took off my jeans and blindfolded me with it to prevent me from seeing them. Our sources say, initially, most of the transactions took place under holly trucks and sometimes in the full glare of passers-by. But some NGOs have brought some decency to the job through peer education and preventive measures against STIs and HIV and AIDS. Abana is a peer educator and a person living with HIV. I want to tell them is if they don't want to stop the work, they should use condom, so if even the if they are offered Bapana. billions of CDs. They should not agree but insist and on the use of condom. With all these efforts, there are still a few who did not adhere to the use of condoms. They claim that some of their clients do not like the use of condoms but rather prefer.